Hey, orange one here. So we have a little situation where we got to get out of here. We're getting hungry. Our character is is starving. It's not good. I haven't been able to find like any food down here. So I think we gotta we gotta work our way out. So what we're gonna try and do is use this hallway to kill some of these guys and maybe get some loot from them, and then work our way up a little cheesy but it should it should work in theory um gonna do something like that so as they see us we can kind of control that hello let's get um do something like that how much damage did that do actually did a good amount. Cool. I'm just gonna actually honestly just close that door. Let you do your thing. Just hang out here for a little bit. Maybe he'll wander away. Probably not. I'll probably have to actually kind of like maneuver around him. Oh yeah, there's actually a lot of them. Fun. Let's see what what are we gonna need to do here. Okay, can I do a little something like that? Okay. Still don't like this. I'm gonna repeat that, I don't like this. Okay. This is this is okay though. There's three of them there, I think, right now. We'll do something like that. And then Keep on coming. I don't wanna I don't have to fight them. I'm just gonna kinda go down and hope that they don't come down with me. Maybe they will though. Or that. Uh yes. Without catching my breath. Are you coming over here, buddy? You are. Okay. Um we need to make more of those traps, I think, or something. Because I mean, it worked. It worked fairly well. It was it was not the worst idea. It just didn't work completely as intended. <laughs> but we're okay. We're definitely okay. Okay. Um. Yeah. Maybe we make another nail board trap. I think that there's two of them up there. If I wanted to, I probably could fight them. I'm just afraid that our clothes are going to get busted and we don't really have much carrying capacity. I'd rather not do that if I don't have to. Um, if I want to make another nail board trap, what would I need? I need more nails. Okay. Where are those going to be? i to be in here. Uh, where am I? I've got my crowbar equipped. That's great. That should take these out actually relatively quickly or not. There we go. See, there'll be there'll be nails around here. Just like on there. And then we just do this. Nail board. Yes, please. Drop that. Can we do another nail board? Uh need some more nails, okay. And then there we go, and the one that can another trap. Bang. We got ourselves another thing to hurt zomb the zombies with. They're down here causing us trouble. I think what I'm gonna do is just take a gander up here. Maybe with my flashlight on. Yeah, okay. Let's uh let's let's have a look see what, what's going on there. We're gonna just close that in case they went that way. Uh, what's the deal up here? Not really anything. Okay. Zapper zombie. That sounds not good. Can I just uh, have a look see around us? Yeah, that that sounds like something that I really don't want to deal with. Um, there was at least two zombies. I think in that hallway there, but I think I can kill the zapper 
probably want to do that. Can I grab that and actually yeah, push this up? Ooh, actually, ooh, ah, let go of that. Run, run away, fall back. I don't know how many others there are, is the thing. If it wants to pursue me, I'm down. We can see what we do here in the hallway. See how this goes for you, friend. Your other compadres over there. They're not gonna help you out. Uh, you did this like pass over that? I think it did. Like almost positive it did. Uh, can I lure it away somewhere? I don't know, is it not following me? Safe mode is on, wait. Stop running for a minute. It's it seems to be just fine there. Okay. Very nervous about yeah, that's not step up. I I had a feeling it was gonna come down. Come here. Get ya fairly far away. From where where we we want to be, can I actually just get it like in here somewhere? Is it up there? Hey, come here. Can I just run away from it now? And, like hide in the shadows? Yeah. <laughs> cool. It doesn't see me. Nice. Take that zapper. <laughs> hey, come over here. Don't go near the door. <laughs> Perfect. I love it. Okay, so the zapper has been stored away somewhere for now. Uh, prisoner zombie. Come down with me. Come here. Yeah, step there. And then you're gonna kinda follow me. Just kinda close those actually on you. And then position myself. I'm gonna set it up so I've got the trap here. Where is it? Nail book trap. Let's get that set up here. Maybe not there. No. Hold on. <laughs> Set that up here. It'll it'll just be a little bit more of a direct line. So is it gonna come down? I have safe mode on. Is it is it I don't I don't know. Sometimes these things can be a little annoying like that, yeah. Come here. Uh, oh no, the zappers come back out. Oh no. I need to be careful here. Oh, he did step on it. That's that's good. That's a good sign. But now he's got a friend that's like out there somewhere. So we need to be kind of careful with that zapper. We gotta continue. Yeah, it's gonna chase me here. Cool. So I thought we can do something like that and then get back on the spike trap. <laughs> this is one way to slowly wean them down. Oh, hello, prisoner zombie. Where did you come from? Why don't you step on that for me? Are you bleeding? Oh, yeah, they're bleeding. Cool. Yeah, let's, let's do that. We'll let them kind of do their thing. I don't know if the zapper, the zapper's probably gonna see me right away. I just listen. Yeah, he's right, right there. If I just listen, just waiting. Yeah, that's why I figured if I, you know what we can do is we can lure them to sound. Oh, we can't get into that little room. It's a shame. 
Hello, prisoner zombie. I had a feeling you're gonna be there. You're actually okay. You're not doing too bad. Why don't you kind of follow me and we'll kind of do what we did to the zapper to you? That's weird. It got out of the room. Oh. Game. It, it did the zombie magic trick that they do. They can they uh, can kind of like travel through walls when you're not around. Yeah. If the, you get too far away from them. Zapper. Yeah, we're good. Where's that Zapper? Hello, Zapper. If I try and peek up there, is that the the one down there? Can I have a look? See, yeah, it does kind of look like it is. All right then. So. I think what we're gonna do is try and get the zapper to run over to this kind of because I think it, it works pretty well. Always thing for him to step on. I'm actually gonna then run in here. Yeah, have him chase me. I'm over here. And then I'm gonna do a little shimmy like that. Come on out, and he'll, he should step on the spike trap again, or not, this is weird, come here, that was super weird, very strange, <laughs> it seems to not be able to figure out, come over here. Why are you not? There we go. Come here. Okay, it's coming. Step on that. It didn't. Ah, it didn't trigger for some reason. It seems to trigger sometimes, but not all the time. I'm not sure why. We'll do something like this. Get you kind of on the counter. Yeah, these zombies are not hard to outsmart if you know kind of like how they work. You know, you can totally outmaneuver and walk them on traps and like other obstacles like debris. Ah, uh, he, he, he dodged it. Look too smart, this one. How do we get you over here? Yep, that's all good for you, but I'm... Um, a little too quick for that. <laughs> Trust me, with my health, this is actually probably one of the better plans. Um, where are you? Why do you keep on doing that? Here we go. I do. I do not understand. There seems to be something kind of weird happening with the pathing. Oh, here we go. There we go. That I think should do it. No, that did not kill him. Maybe the next one it will. Right? Gotcha. Come here. Okay. Oh, ow. I did not expect them to be able to hit me like that. Okay, maybe I should just hit them. We're gonna we're gonna do this not like that because that's how you get your gear ripped and like RNGs blessed us by not having it get ripped so far. Here we go. Mine are bleeding. Are you gonna bleed out, maybe? No. Dang. Okay. Let's just wait a minute and scare our breath back. <laughs> Ooh, I think it did die. Yeah, that's how we do it. Um, nothing that I really want. 
I am going to get that spiked board, pick it up, and add it to our little hallway. And do like, something like that. That way we can just kind of dodge and they'll, they'll go over them a decent amount. I'm going to turn off our flashlight at first because we have night vision. I'm going to let that work to my advantage. Look out there. Right there. Looks pretty good. Before we try and drag anything out, can I just have a little glance in here? What's in here? Bolt cutters, clamp, hacksaw. Maybe I do want to check that out. I'm not hearing anything. What else do we have here? A wrench. We really do want the wrench. Oh my gosh, if we... Man, we have, like, really good engineering things already. Um, what do these do? Again... I don't really think that bolt cutters have like any real practical use. There's a proper hammer. I probably should replace my makeshift hammer with that. Get that real hammer. The hammer we can drop. Watch that ends up being something I want to come back for. <laughs> Is that a kitchen that's just to herself? Is this silly of me? That one can't get to me, can it? That might make noise. Oh, it's locked. Yeah, I bet that, that does look like that's the kitchen. Here's our conundrum is I think I can get out of here. But I don't know if I want to try and open this door first. Ah, uh, there's a prisoner zombie there. Okay, it's probably going to see me anyways if I try and do anything. Can I... Uh... Bash is nine. I can't do anything to get that, no. And the makeshift crowbar is not going to do that either. Okay, so what we want to do then is... And we could try and make a lockpicking kit and do it quiet. Yeah, that's probably what I wanted to try and try and do. Just do that real quick. And it hasn't worked at all so far. I think we're getting some proficiency in it, right? I actually haven't played with proficiencies at all, so I don't really know how it works. Is it like, oh, there's proficiencies here? Okay. I don't know. Maybe I'm gonna... Let's just... Let's just knock the door down. We need that food, is, is the thing. Uh, uh, where is it? I don't see my crowbar. I feel like it would be in the tools, right? It's not there. Not in containers. Um, no. I wield. Let's just look at our bash values. There's that that has bash nine, wrench that has bash nine, um, and there's some planks bash ten. That's weird. I guess we must have left our crowbar down somewhere. It's weird. I don't remember dropping it. Maybe we dropped it when we made the nail board. Yeah, that's probably what happened. Yeah, that's what happened. Go get that back. Yep, and wield it, please. Thank you. We're gonna see. Actually, maybe we can use that to crowbar our way out. I don't think we can. We can try. We could also use those nail board traps on the zombies in that hallway to really help ourselves out. In the long term, that would not be the worst idea. Oh, here we go. This dude has spotted us. Come on over, little zombie. Come down to my little hallway. I think you'll like it. 
Go ahead. Nope. Oh no. Good step there. Ah. Can I dodge them? Annoying. We'll have to bring him back up there. Or not. Maybe we'll just trap him down here somewhere. Safe mode on. Can I just kinda wait for them or are they gonna come? Oh, he's he's right there. Okay. I think that there's others down this way, but I can't remember. Why don't you come over here, friend? There's oh, there's another one right there. Why don't we just come on over here? And then we'll just uh, back up a little bit. And run around you guys. See ya. Whatever. <laughs> we're almost we're almost out of here, I honestly think so. I think that we're pretty close. Um Yeah. Do something like so. And looks good to me. I'm trying to look in there, yeah, that's that's okay. I think that I am gonna try and smash our way in. Come on, door. There we go, it is kind of collapsing. Okay. Managed to get in. Just gonna make sure that we don't end up getting trapped. See here we got some frozen food and stuff. Oh, this is this is perfect. Cool. Okay, we are not gonna die. Yeah, we're totally fine now. That this oh man, this is like seriously amazing. Wow, it's locked. Okay. Well I don't think that we need to leave. I think that we actually have food to stay here for a little bit. And as, as silly as that seems, that might be the best move for us. To kind of hang out here with the, the zombies in the lab and, and train up while we've got our, our little food stock here. In our little our little room. We do have a well-cornered off, well-lit room right here with like some stations and, and all kinds of stuff. We could, we could work with this, you know? It could definitely work. In the short term, at least, we have some, some options. Um, can I eat any of this? Yes, actually, it is starting to be edible. Cool. Yum, yum, yum. Your character, like, hasn't ate in a while, so... Probably good to just fill up. Yay. I wonder if they're sleepy as well. Be getting kind of tired. Maybe we should sleep and heal up somewhere. Where was that one bed? We have like some kind of bed area. Is it safe still? We had like... Oh yeah, there was that dude that's that was like right here, right? That we were kind of dealing with. I don't know if he's still there or not. I think they are, but I just can't hear them or see them. So can we sleep here? Is that something that our character would like to do? I think that they probably would. Um, yeah, maybe try and there. There's a lot of yelling going on, so we're not gonna be able to sl sleep, are we? Yeah, we're hearing all kinds of craziness. Um, do we get noise canceling? No. Any ear ear bags? <laughs> okay, that's not what we're looking for. Uh, yeah, ear plugs would be great, but it looks like we don't have any. Great, so we're not gonna be able to sleep here. Okay, so much for having a base here, surrounded by the zombies. We can't really do that until we get maybe our crafting up. I needed to get that washboard, but I don't know. 
I'm also just curious about the surface, what else we have access to up there. There might be some other really good stuff, like... If I go in here, what do I have access to here? Are these canned goods? Oh yeah. Here are the canned goods. Yeah. Oh man. We have so much so much food here. Our character's been like starving. And look at all this. This is like positively amazing. <laughs> that's that's so cool. Oh, can we get heating elements here? Oh. Will I, will I get ambushed? That's also the other possibility that I may be careful of. Can I just drag, uh... Hold on. Can I do, just bring that there and then grab that and put that there? Cool. I can. Can I also grab these? No. I can. Okay, cool. I am going to barricade with that. Maybe not. Um, hello, friend. I did not see you there. Okay, uh, what are we going to do about this? Let's dodge and weave a little bit. I had a feeling there was going to be someone around here. It's going to cause problems for me. I was trying to get my heating elements. Okay. We do know there are heat heating elements there, though. That we can get. I think just might get one of my traps and, and just use one of them. Drop that, it's fine. We're not really using actual melee combat right now. Being a little bit cowardly for that. We're just gonna put this in the middle and then we're gonna run around them, I think. Right? Should I be able to duck and, and, and weave a little bit? Maybe maybe in the commons area. Yeah, let's do this. Where is it? Right there. No, don't step on it. Let's have a look see. Is there anything else that oh, hello. Oh, there's a clang going, there's something over there. Oh, hello. Yeah, come here. This is what I want. Yes. Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna run up in the way. Oh, I can hide behind furniture. I love it. Yeah, this dude is gonna step on that a few times, trust me. We just, like, do something like that, and he's gonna just come right back. Hello. Right there. It rinse repeat, you know? Eventually he will die. It's, it's all part of these games, is that you gotta know how to kite. It does feel a little cheesy, though. And he's stepping on a nail again and again. That would hurt. I, I do want to emphasize that I do feel like that aspect of that mechanic is fair. <laughs> um, okay, that, he almost got me there. Come on, dude. Yeah, he's going to go down soon. Is there another one that's outside, or is that me just, that character just is hearing me a little off? Maybe you can, you can come over here, yeah. Oh, hello. He, he got a little close there. You do have to be careful, you do get close from time to time. Okay, he should bleed out. Okay. Take that down, I guess. Ooh, 
Outdoor Adventures, that's actually a pretty good book. Um, I'm gonna take the stuff and, and move it. Hold on, though. There was... Yeah, I do kind of want to get those. That book, Outdoor Adventures, that might give me something I can craft with that I want to use. I'm going to kind of wait here for a little bit. Grab that and move that like so. And we're gonna try and um, maybe it's too deconstruct, too dark to reconstruct. Okay. Well, I don't want to get spotted from way over that a ways. So maybe if I grab this, let's uh. I drag this go, right? Then if I do this with the flashlight and people kinda see me, am I gonna get bothered? I feel like I am. Yep, yeah, I thought so. Um run grab that and push that out of the way. I don't know how many were around, but got a little nervous. Yeah, they, they definitely have a little, little force. Okay. Um, <laughs> never mind. I guess, well, we have food. You know, we just gotta clear out this yard a little bit. That's gonna be probably our mission, is to clear out this yard, find somewhere quiet enough to sleep, and get set up somewhere that we can actually sleep. All right. Cool. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.